And President Uhuru Kenyatta officially opened the newly upgraded Mathare Korogosha Level 5 Hospital, which has uh, changed uh, to the Mama Margaret Kenyatta Children Hospital. Kenich, the five-story facility whose uh, construction had stalled since the 1990s, was finally completed last year after Nairobi Metropolitan Services took over its renovation. Raquel Muigai with more details. As part of the Jubilee government agenda of improving healthcare and making it accessible and affordable for all, residents of Madari North area and its environs can now enjoy an upgraded and specialized facility after President Uhuru Kenyatta officially opened the Mama Margaret Kenyatta Children's Hospital KNH on Friday. This is a job that was abandoned way back in the 90s. Just derelict buildings. And for a few months, Ninafuraha tele tukiwa hapa tena, tukiwa sasa, tunaifungua kirasmi, na tukiwa tumeingia, na tunaona wananchi wa sehemu hii, wakitibiwa na wataalamu wetu ambao wako hapa. The construction of the 350-bed capacity hospital to be managed by Kenyatta National Hospital was revived by the Nairobi Metropolitan Service in July 2021 after stalling for over 30 years due to administrative and financial constraints. In December 2021, the NMS renamed it the Mama Margaret Kenyatta Hospital. The naming of this hospital as the Mama Margaret Uhuru Hospital is in recognition, in appreciation of the work of the First Lady as far as the health sector is concerned. She started Linda Mama and committed herself to the work of ensuring that babies and mothers are health-wise secure. The hospital was upgraded to ease pressure on Kenyatta National Hospital and Mama Lucy Kibaki Hospital in Islands, which serves over 2.1 million people. This is hospital Ndiyo itakuwa referral hospital ya zile hospital ndogo ndogo ambazo tumekuwa tukijenga katika sehemu mbalimbali. In August 2020, President Uhuru Kenyatta directed NMS to construct 24 hospitals in informal settlements to avail health services closer to the people as part of the government's efforts to revolutionize healthcare through the rolling out of the Universal Health Coverage UHC. Within another month, another month and a half, the remaining works that need to be done in order to make this a proper referral hospital shall be complete. And there can be no clearer indication that it is bearing fruit than to know that the hospitals that are now receiving the highest in terms of refunds and payments from NHIF are public facilities. The Level 6 hospital is NHIF accredited and will offer services such as mental health treatment, radiology, surgeries and outpatient services for children. Raquel Mugai, Citizen TV.